easier to carry for them. Last year at this time, Olivia Nazareth had a simple wish. So, what do you think Christmas next year is going to look like? Um, well, hopefully a lot of family over. <laughs> it was supposed to be the case. Now you got me emotional, I, didn't, I wasn't planning on, yeah. It was the plan, we got the tickets for my parents to come here and everything, but then my sister got sick. When you live half a world away from your family, moments together are precious. But Flavia Nazareth hasn't been able to hug her mother or sister for more than two years now. During the summer... It's been over a year now. They might one want when I miss you guys and I want to have you guys over and I can't. They stayed in touch over Zoom. How are you feeling after the second dose? But we all know that's Freedom. never the same. Freedom. And for much of this year, her home country of Brazil was burning with COVID infections. How are things in Sao Paulo, Claudia? Trying to move on. Yeah. Uh, you guys are... still in the lockdown or no? Although Flavia was a lawyer back in Brazil. My passion has always been with kids and art because of my dad and all my experience in, the, uh, in my childhood. When she moved to America, she opened this art studio and school in High Point called Little Blank Canvas. Uh, the metaphor, if you will, was how I was feeling when I moved here. I had like all the possibilities, but the overwhelming feeling of looking at this blank canvas and like, oh my gosh, I can do so much in anything. For years it flourished, but you know where this is going. Like so many things, COVID shut it down. If it wasn't for the pandemic, I think I would never allow myself to rethink the, the, the business model. Pode ser qualquer tom de vermelho, qualquer tom de azul. She took her teaching virtual and discovered something. I was so limited to my community, to the people I know, people that would live like maybe five, ten miles from me. And suddenly I have the entire ocean to fish. Os parques, a natureza, para fazer uma harmonia com o trabalho que eles queriam passar. But I was able now to connect with people in Brazil. So I'm teaching in Portuguese. Então eles iam para o mundo para pintar outdoors. For her daughter, Olivia, doing middle school virtually was much more of a struggle. With the online, I mean, I would actually get to talk to my friends more because I just FaceTime them after live meetings which would be amazing, which is way more talking than what we can do in class. Um, but the other thing is just like being there, connecting with the teacher and having the work like in front of you, like you handed to you. Your, uh, your learning process? Oh, 100%. Like the online wasn't that good. I show them um, Van Gogh's Starry Night. Okay. So we talk a little bit about impressionism. As things subsided a bit, Flavia was able to restart in-person classes in her home. But it seems some things are forever changed. I feel like I cannot plan for anything in my life. And before I was the control freak-ish, and now I'm just like, okay, we, we go as we go. That spontaneity led to a Thanksgiving trip to Paris planned just a week or so before. And it's also led to a newfound peace of mind. Whatever comes, we'll be okay. Bob Buckley. We find a way around it. Fox 8 News. Yeah.